Raphael Dawkins with the Combat Radio. And <laughs> a very interesting assessment of the Joshua versus Usyk fight from David Hay. And uh, let's get into it. Okay. So, David Hay says Joshua will knock out Alexander Usyk with a jab. <laughs> OMG, made me smile, so we have to talk about it, okay, so David Hay, the former two division champion, is backing Anthony Joshua to score a big knockout victory over Alexander Usyk, okay, so obviously we all know Usyk was a former undisputed cruiserweight lineal championship <laughs> um, but lineal in that case means something sometimes lineal doesn't mean much and sometimes it does mean much in the case of Alexander Usyk he wiped out his division unlike another cat who claims to be lineal but has not wiped out his division <laughs> for lineal to have any weight whatsoever um, it needs to mean something it needs to mean, it needs to mean that you've cleaned out your division. You've knocked off the best guys in your division. One guy has done that. And he goes by the name of Alexander Usyk. One guy has not done that. But every two minutes he's talking about his lineal, but he ain't cleaned out his division. He ain't beat the top guys in his division. He beat one guy in the division like six years ago and another like, what, two years ago, a year and a half. Yeah, no, that's not lineal. Lineal is wiping out the division, proving that you're the best. Uh, unless you've done that, shut it. <laughs> shut it up. You know what I'm saying? Wipe out the division or shut your trap. That's, uh, I think that's the best policy. Okay, so let's continue with this one. Okay, so yeah, where, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Let's look. Hay believes, Hay believes that Usyk, Hay believes Usyk to be too small. Um, I think his style might be, I think his style might be very effective if uh, Joshua was 6'2 and 14 stone, but that ain't the case. That's not the case. Joshua is 6'6 and apparently an absolute specimen. One of the best athletes ever to step foot in the heavyweight division. And, uh, of course, he's going around wiping out the best in his division. Uh, well, the best that will fight. Um, I think he's already beat guys better than Wilder. Um, unfortunately, but anyway, let's not, let's not talk about, let's not talk about cats who don't want to fight. Okay. What's going on here? What's going on here? He should have beaten. Chisora by an easy landslide, but he didn't. He wasn't able to keep the heavier man off him. He didn't have the firepower. I just don't see AJ having any problems. I'll tell you exactly what punch it's going to be. It's going to be a jab, right hand, and then a straight jab again. OMG. The jab will knock Usyk out. He will knock Usyk out with a jab. Okay. So what's going on here? To beat the big men, the big monsters at heavyweight, you have to have a big punch to get their respect. Keep them off you. He doesn't have the fire, fire power to keep the big men off him. So the big men are going to be on it when they choose to be. Okay, so let's have a little further dive, investigation, let's see what's going on, what's going on with Joshua, what's he doing, let's have a little looky, go on then, okay, so, line this up, okay, so, what's going on here, what's going on here, seeing I think it's Joshua keeping his head off the center line. Very 
important attribute. So Boatsy the other day said was like he was, he was he was like he was in the halo. Remember the halo that uh, what's his name was it? Was, who, who the hell was that American boxer who had his who snapped his neck and had to have his head in a halo? You know what I mean? Look like something out of some sky fi shiznicks. Vinny Pazienza was it? Vinny Pazienza is that the pronunciation? Is that the pronunciation? Okay, so Joshua's keeping his head off the center line, making himself a more elusive target. I like this, sir. Uh, I like this routine. I like this routine. Dipping off to the side, and coming up straight down the middle. Of course, you can use hooks with this as well. Good, very good drill. Very good drill. Okay, so what say you? David Hay says that Joshua takes out. Alexander Usyk with the jab. What say you? It's the Raphael Dawkins. It's the comeback radio. It's the like. It's the subscribe. It's the comments. It's the shares. It's the hitting the bell icon to stay updated with news and notifications. And don't forget about the live show. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Oh, the live show tonight, by the way, about 9, 10 p.m. UK time. Make the adjustments, the relevant adjustments, the necessary adjustments for your local time zone. I'm out.